Hello everybody. This is um, Orion's Girl 93 um, coming to you. I haven't done a video in a little while. I wanted to actually show you how I do my planner stickers. This is just my own personal way that I keep track of them that I found works for me. Um, I have this cute little binder and all the little extra stickers. I put the names of the companies I've been putting on my binder just so I can keep track of them. And plus, I think it looks cute. Um, just a one inch binder with um, the little sleeves. I can put stuff in it if I need to. And I put in a ton of um, um, like hard cardstock. And I three hole punched it. And I just started taping them and layering them so I'll fit more on one page. Um, I was, I had the mistake of taping it down all the way down. Um, and that was a problem because um, you can't lift it up and like get that sticker off when it's all the way stuck down like that. So <clears throat> it's much better to like a tape runner or a piece of tape so it this part's always open it's a little difficult when you're folding the pages um, but you just got to be careful and it's not a big deal these are ones that I printed out and I have not cut up yet and all of the ones in here are ones that I purchased and um, I don't really have any major categories listed I'm going to go through them and um, put the little tabs um, on them when I get some themes going. These are all my llama stickers. I love llamas. And um, sorry, a lot of curse words. I like curse word stickers. Uh, that's just who I am. I'm sorry if that offends you, but I do like the curse word stickers. The more the merrier. And see, it, it flips over easily, and I like that I can get more on one page. And this just works for me. It really, it really does. Um, I love like little character stickers. These are Laney's from um, Miscellaneous Boulevard. I love the flamethrower ones. Um, these are just like stickopotamus ones, you know, random. Um, more curse word stickers. I have a very intense job, so I just sort of have a lot of curse word stickers. Um, these are, see, sometimes like if I took the sticker off here, that's what it was, the company, and I put it on here, and I'm not going to remember when I do a tag on Instagram, so I'll have to write on here, you know, but I could always put something else over that later. I love anything with little you know, vintage people. Um, these are from Bella Rose. Love this set. Oh, and I love, love, love um, uh, these stickers. The Kawhi type stickers. The little planners. Look at these little planners. Oh my gosh, aren't they cute? These are adorable. Love them. Um, more planner stickers. You know, on Sundays we got a plan, and I have a ton of emojis, and I just keep layering them and layering them because I love my emojis. Same thing with the weather stickers. You could just keep putting them underneath and storing them that way. This is my Libyan company. Weekend rainbow stickers. These are my favorite weekend stickers so far because I have the horizontal um, Aaron Condren. Um, let me show you. I really, really, really like the um, the weekend stickers that go up like that, like this. I really like that. Oops, so that works for me. Love my payday stickers. Goes right in the corner. Okay, these are just basic icons and stuff. I love the ones that say "Nope." <laughs> Boo, you whore. <clears throat> These came with the Aaron Condren planner, so I kept them in the little pouch in the back, and I wasn't using them, so I said, let me get them out so I'll start using them, and I did. There's some more that were in the back. I think these came in my notebook. I can't remember. 
Um, so my Libby and Company. I ruined one because I didn't know how to write on these. This is my first uh, set of Libby stickers. And then I um, posted about it and someone said that you had to use the Sharpie markers, not the Sharpie pens. And that's what I had. So, but lesson learned. These are just different sets that I have. These are store-bought. Um, some more Libby icons. Love, I love her stickers. Here's another one I did last week. This was my, um, let me see if I can show you. This was my, um, last week. I had a bunch of, um, Libby and company this way. This right here. I love her weekend stickers. So cute. All right, moving on. More icons, and I love vintage. This is Tough Love Stickers Company. How cute that is. Um, I have something else from them. Excuse me. I am a New Orleans girl, so I'm a Saints fan, and I collect a lot of Fleur de Lis, black and gold. So that's why you'll see that a lot. And these are um, Imagine That stickers. Shark Week, pain levels, scales. Um, this is the other one, the vintage laundry stickers from Tough Love. Really cute. And I just got these too. Aren't they cute? I love the laundry ones. And the little vintage TVs. Very cute. I think I used that this week on my layout right here. For Saturday Night Live, put it on there. I really love this layout for this week. These are all um, the ladies. These are all uh, vintage Gypsy Rose. All right, am I going the right way? No. Uh, um, watch a lot of TV. My favorite shows are Game of Thrones. I actually printed this out. Monica's Marbles. She's got great, great printables, um, and I just cut them out as I need them. And um, they're, they're very easy to cut. I don't have a silhouette or anything like that. So I just cut them out as I need them. And it makes life really easy. And this is um, one that I cut out because the Game of Thrones starts in, what, two weeks? And then my other favorite show, which just went off, is The Walking Dead. So I have a lot of of those and I'm going to just keep collecting them. I have some more on order. My favorite, favorite show. This is all stuff for the movies. Movie stickers and vintage. Half week humping. Midweek. Gotta get my camels for hump day. I love the ones from Salty. Love them. I just got these in from um, Creative Keo. These are adorable. Um, another thing that I enjoy is these little dolls, these little nesting dolls. I have several of those. And I have a ton, ton, ton of coffee stickers. I am a coffee nut. More coffee. These are from um, Kina Prince. Her stickers are amazing. They're very inexpensive. It takes a little while to get to you because I think they come from the Philippines, if I remember correctly. But these are hers. These are hers. I think all of these are hers. And she has the cutest stickers. They're small, but she packs a lot in one little one little card. Um, I love her stickers. So I just placed another order. I'm going to be getting a ton of the little, the little people. These are just some Walmart ones I threw in there. Um, with every order, you get a lot of sample samplers. So I just didn't know what to do with them. So I kind of just made um, their own section, I guess you'd say. Um, and I, I like that. So I could just go look for little tiny um, samplers, cut out what I need or whatever. So I have all my samplers on here. Um, Kimber says relax. Vintage Libby Company. This one's Creative Keo. 
I think this one was cinnamon designs. I just got this one yesterday. These came from Australia. I love the lazy day for the horizontal from Creative Pio. More samplers. Sorry, y'all have a cold. Um, this came from Dragon Hughes, I believe. Um, the little sticker shop. Tough Love stickers. Stickers for Katie. I use all my little Thanksgiving ones. I'll just keep them on here. These are just some Michaels random stickers. I use the little arrows and the little geotag a lot. Um, this is actually purple and green. I was using it for Mardi Gras because I'm in New Orleans, of course, and we have a lot of Mardi Gras stuff. And plus, go wild. Um, I'm on planners. I'm in Planners Gone Wild, and they're having a, um, sorry, they're having a, um, a conference down here in May, so that's exciting. All right, and here's my Valentine's section, and I have a ton of them, and I just labeled them on top of each other. These are from Florida Lee Planners. I won one of her contests, and I also, um, placed an order, so I got a bunch of stickers from her. Libby and Company. I love this set. It's so pretty. I haven't used it yet. Um, these are just random stickers. I think I got at Walmart or Michaels. These are Florida Lee sampler. This is from Kimber Says Relax. This was a freebie in my order. I love it. This one's Aquarius. That's my sign. Love it. Some more random. Oh, these are adorable. These are from um, Florida Lee. <clears throat> and we do a lot of crawfish boils down here in Louisiana. So there's like crawfish, washi, and the boxes with crabs and crawfish. And then, then these are little boil pots. Oh, they're adorable. Love them. And here we go. And to my sink stickers, my um, Florida Lees, and my tigers. We got that LSU football going. She sent me those, and then we have the Florida Lee, like, New Orleans sampler. I used a bunch of these already. Every icon you can think of from down here. And then we have some of the boxes. I absolutely love these. I'm hoarding them. Let's see. Oh, she sent me these also. These are all the um, different, you know, Cajun or New Orleans way of saying things. And I just layer them, keep them there like that. And these are from her also, the Florida Lee um, list, checkoff lists. And here's some of the boxes. Sometimes I'll just cut these in half and use them. Mardi Gras stickers I used this year. She sent me a ton of these. I bought some and then I got some in that little contest. Some more. And it's great because when you finish and use a whole thing, you just pull it off. And add some more later. Here's some more Mardi Gras, um, Llama Con, anything that uh, go wild. I use a bunch of these. That's what it's called, go wild. These are from Kimber Says Relax. I just got these. She actually sent these to me as a freebie. Thank you, Kimber. Um, fab fabulously planning. I haven't really used these too much yet. Owls. I like owls. Um, I use a lot of these for thing. Um, Valentine's Day. I think I did these. I haven't used these yet. From Salty Planning Company. It's very cute for the summertime. Um, another, these are Walmart. Walmart. I try not to use these a lot because they're thicker, and they make your book really thick. So. Mm, I try not to use the heavy duty ones that much, but I'll save these for cards and whatnot. I really loved these Walmart stickers, believe it or not. Um, I did an entire layout recently of these. They were so pretty. Let me see if I can find it. Easy. Oh, yeah, here we go. They just came out really pretty. It doesn't even matter what size your book is. They're just really, really pretty. Again, Walmart, Walmart stickers. Um, who's this from? I think this is Vintage Gypsy Rose. 
Walmart or Michaels, I'm not sure at this point. I just know I didn't order them. I think these came from Hobby Lobby. I love these. I use these a lot. I'll cut the little people in half if I just need a, a woman or whatever. They're adorable. And let's see, these are for the fall. These are so cute. Tough love stickers. I use these in the fall. I love owls, as you can tell. I have them everywhere. My Christmas. I kind of have everything in order as the seasons for me down here in Louisiana. So this is all Christmas towards the back since I've already used a lot of this up this past holiday season. <clears throat> a lot of Christmas, more Christmas. And the last page is New Year's. So let's see. Flip it back around. Like I said, if you're just careful with the pages, it's very easy to flip through it. Um, Libby and Company, the Planner Nerd stickers. Love. I think I'm going to put this one on my car. But yeah, these are the ones that I um, I will eventually put them in the book. I need a three-hole punch. And then I'll just print out what I want. These were all freebies. These are all ones that I printed out on the internet. Tiffany and Company. The Barbie one. And I just bought a huge box of um, printer paper off of Amazon. It's the digital orange paper. And it sticks very good. I don't have any issues with it. And I like that it's got the, um, it's already perforated. So you can just peel it right off. I like it. It's heavy duty. Good cardstock. Ooh, some more um, Walking Dead freebies look how cute this is coffee and unicorn ah. and for some reason I don't know what happened with this one I accidentally printed it three times so these two I am going to send these out as a rack very soon I'm gonna let people know okay um, and this is just how my page should start I just have them and a three hole punch them at work because I don't have one at home and then I bring them home. Oh, Bob's Burgers. This is also a freebie. This is like our favorite show here. This one, I have a lot of medical issues <clears throat> and my daughter actually made this one for me. It's the Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and it's just different um, um, spoonie related items. If you're a spoonie, headache, nerve pain, anxiety, depression and I've been keeping track of that so I can, you know, talk to my doctor about it or whatever. But she made this for me. I showed her a picture of one and she just did it in colors that I like. And I actually do have a file on that. I'm going to have to upload that if anybody would be interested in that. I can send that to you. Um, but that's just how I plan. That's how, not plan. I'm sorry. That's how I do my um, sticker book. It works well for me. This is one of, I don't know how many I'm going to have, but this is the one that works for me right now. And um, what else do I have? I also have this. When I do cut out all the stickers that I print, I put them in here, in a little box, and I will, um, I will cut them all out. And I just have the whole bunch of the quotes and different things that I like. I needed a bigger box though, but um, I print them all on sticker paper. I sit here at night watching TV or something, you know, YouTube, some funny videos, and I just cut them all out for to, to when I need them. And these um, are for sidebars. These were free. Printed them out. They say currently listening, eating, drinking, wearing, feeling, weather, wanting, needing, thinking, and enjoying. And I'll put that in uh, on my calendar section and fill that out. I like the Netflix ones. We like a lot of Netflix. So you can just write what you're watching. And I guess that's it. I have a, um, a planner drawer that I use. And I keep all of my binders and my stickers and stuff that needs to be put in in there 
And um, that's just how I organize mine. This is this month's. And this is just a few pages. I want to start doing um, plan with me's, but I don't know if anybody would want to watch me plan. <laughs> ah, so this is ready to go, and I appreciate you watching this video if you got this far. Thank you so much. I'm going to have more plan planning with me videos coming soon. Thanks for following, and um, like, please hit the like bar down there. I would really appreciate it. Thank you so much. All right, bye-bye.